have a fabulous day for this event today. We'd like to welcome everybody to the ribbon cutting of the Homestead of Martin Grove. Welcome. I, I'm thrilled to see so many folks here and have been um, really in, been a great experience to get to know so many of you over the last several months as we bring the Homestead of Morton Grove to fruition. We thought it would be appropriate to ask um, a representative from the American Legion of Morton Grove, Mr. John Slater, is going to put the flag up onto our new home. There certainly were a lot of people that uh, we have to thank. Uh, to do this, but David had asked me to say just a few words about how we got here, the road we took to get here, and I can tell you, we were driving on a really slow gravel road for about three or four years, uh, <clears throat> and then once we found out through the Illinois Housing Development Authority that we'd been approved, we quickly moved to the interstate. Uh, <clears throat> we found out in July of 2010 that we've been approved to do this project but we had to be closed by the end of December so in the development world and in the construction world when you have no drawings you didn't have zoning in place at that point in time uh, no no financing really lined up at that point to get from where we were in July to a December 15th closing was there were a lot of people that had to come together to make this happen. And so we really do have a lot of people to thank uh, in getting this accomplished. Uh, certainly on the top of that list would be uh, Mayor Sackman, uh, the trustees, uh, the staff at the village were, I mean, they called special meetings. They met with us anytime we were in town. Without that effort on their part, we wouldn't be here today in front of this finished building. And I can assure you that that's a fact. I, I remember the night in 2004. I don't remember the exact date. The village board met and made a resolution to have a commitment to this community to senior housing and affordable housing. And I remember naysayers coming up to the podium and saying, wishful thinking. It's a feel-good motion that you all are just trying to make yourselves feel good. Well, I feel pretty good right now. <laughs> <laughs> Six years is a long time, but it's such a short time in our lifetimes. And with patience and diligence and a can-do attitude, this became a reality. I'm very happy and very proud of this project and what it means to the community and a little history. If you'd gone back 200 years ago, the river is adjacent to this property across those woods. This area in here was an Indian village. And now 200 years later, it's only so appropriate that it is back a village where people are living and thriving. Thank you all for coming. And thank you, Essex, for having the faith in the village and the Bummel sisters. Patience. Thank you. Thank you very much. I want to thank everyone for coming out today. It's a beautiful day. And at the same time, just you know, from the businesses of Morton Grove, thank you for joining us. It's a beautiful building. It's a wonderful addition to the community. Uh, it's, a, it's a great example of seeing how businesses can work with the government and put together projects and bring them from start to finish. Thank you very much. I think it's time for me to stop talking and Let's do some ribbon cutting at yeah. this point.